What's up guys, it's Legend of Navi, and welcome back to another Undertale Let's Play, and the last episode we just finished basically the tutorial, um, we spared Toriel, um, and Flower knew that we already killed her, but that doesn't really matter because we're doing pacifist, so, I mean, let's just get started, um, why? go to where I was. I guess I didn't save. I thought it automatically saved after the Undertale thing. But yeah, I'll go back and we'll get past this part. I honestly don't know why this happened, but yeah, we'll be right back. Alright guys, so I just did the Toriel fight and Flowey, which Flowey was actually different that time. Um, again, like, I don't even know how. Um, but yeah, there's a camera here. We know that. So we're in this creepy wooded area. It's pretty creepy. And the music's kind of weird too. Oh, there's a twig right there. Okay, it just snapped. Uh, yeah. I already know what's going to happen, but for those of you who don't, it's kind of creepy. <laughs> Wait a second. I just saw a shadow. I just saw a shadow. Man, this. I feel like these, like walkways are super long now. That music seemed really creepy. Oh, we got a mysterious figure walking up behind us. Human. Frisk is like, um, yeah. Weird. Whatever. You're a human, right? I'm Sans. Sans a skeleton. I'm actually supposed to be on the watch for humans right now. But, you know. I don't really care about capturing anybody. Now my brother, Papyrus. He's a human hunting fanatic. Hey, actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thingy. Yeah, go right through it. My bro made the bar too wide to stop anyone. Quick, behind that conveniently shaped lamp. What's up, bro? Oh, I thought that was for first. You know what's up, brother? It's been eight days and you still haven't calculated your puzzles? You just hang around outside your station. What are you even doing? Staring at those slides. It's really cool. Do you want to look? No, I don't have time for that. What if a human comes through here? I want to be ready. I will be the one. I must be the one. I will capture a human. Then I, the great papyrus, will look at all the things I utterly deserve. Respect, recognition. I will finally be able to join the royal guard. People will ask to be my friend. I will bathe in the shower kisses every morning. Okay, you're getting a little weird now. Hmm. I'm ready to will help you. Sans? You're not helping you, lazy bones. All you do is sit on the sit and boondog. You get lazier and lazier every day. Hey, take it easy. I've got a ton of work done today. <laughs> a skeleton. <laughs> Sans! Come on, you're still smiling. Yeah. Why does someone as great as me have to do so much to get some recognition? Wow, sounds like you're really working yourself. Down to the bone. Goodness. Ah, I will attend to my puzzles. As for you, as for your work, put a little more backbone into it. <laughs> hey. Okay, you can come out now. Okay. You ought to 
get going, he might come back. And if he does, you'll have to sit through more of my hilarious jokes. Alright, well, we're gonna go now. Actually, hey. Hate to bother you. Can you do me a favor? I was thinking, my brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before, and seeing you might make his day. Don't worry, he's not dangerous. Even if he tries to be. Thanks a million. I'll be up ahead. And he walks the other direction. And that's the thing about Sans. He can teleport or something. Because he can just do that. File saved. Snowden. Alright, so this is where... This is a box. You can put items inside or take an item out. The same box will appear later, so don't worry about coming back. Sincerely, a box lover. Alright. Yes. Um, what do we got here? We got the toy knife. We're not going to need that. Um, we can take the tough glove. Oh, uh, yeah. We're going to go next. So, what, let's look. Let's look. Oh, I, I, okay. I'm thinking of this as the Toriel fight. We actually have to, like... See you after. People actually like my joke. There we go. Oh, we got 12 gold from that. It's pretty good, actually. It's a fishing rod affixed to the ground. Reel it in? Yes. All that's attached to the end of the... End is a photo of a weird looking monster. Call me. Here's my number. You decide not to call. <laughs> of course not. So, as I was saying about Undyne. Sounds, oh my god, is that. A human? Uh, actually, I think that's a rock. Oh, hey. What's that in front of the rock? Oh my god, is, is that a human? Yes. Oh my god, and I finally did it. I'm dying, Will. I'm gonna, I'll be so popular, 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 popular. And human, you shall not pass this area. I, the great papyrus, will stop you. I will capture you. You will be delivered to the capital. Then, then. I'm not sure what's next. In any case, continue. Only if you dare. <laughs> well, that went well. Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep an eye socket out for you. Sans is like the best character in the game. I'm just gonna say that right now. My hat's too loud. Loud for me? What? Oh crap. What? Did you just say snowing? It's snowing dandruff? That's kinda cool. It's kinda gross. Don't, who doesn't know? Oh, yes. Oh, they come back now. Okay. Oh, not yet. Wow, this guy's actually pretty hard. For my cat that has a great hat. Duh, who doesn't know? Alright, well, we're gonna have to ignore him. Oh, I forgot. I accidentally pressed the spider, sorry. We're gonna ignore it. Oh, that, that definitely looks like ignoring. There we go. Alright. Let's see what this is. There is some narration on the cardboard box. You observed the well-crafted sentry station. Who could have built this? You ponder. I bet it was that very famous royal no not yet a very famous royal guardsman. <laughs> Alrighty. 
absolutely no moving. Well, I'm moving right now. Actually, am I moving? Or am I just kind of on a hoverboard or something like that? <laughs> Did something move? Was it my imagination? I can only see moving things. If something was moving, for example, a human, I'll make sure it never moved again. Doggo blocks away. Alright. Doggo's a pretty cool guy. So, we're gonna pet him. Doggo's too suspicious of your movements. Don't move an inch. So, we literally don't move. That's what the blue attacks are. Obviously, some of you guys don't know. So, yeah. The blue attacks, you just don't move at all. And you're good. Oh, well. We can already spare him. Oh, freeze. 30 gold. Nice. This, uh, something pet me something something that isn't moving i'm gonna need some dog treats for this <laughs> oh doggo someone's been smoking dog treats oh okay doggo you smoke dog treats that's nice hey here's something important to remember i don't know why i'm being very sexy. my brother has a very special attack you see a blue attack don't move and it won't hurt you Here's an easy way to keep it in mind. Imagine a stop sign. When you see a stop sign, you stop, right? Stop signs are red. So imagine a blue stop sign instead. It's simple, right? When fighting, think about blue stop signs. Okay. Thanks, bud. And we are just gonna make our way over here. So. Ice. East Snowden Town. And ice. <laughs> Alright. What's up here? Oh, never mind. We got a lesser dog appears. Okay, so there's actually an Easter egg with this guy. I'm not gonna do it, but if you keep petting it, um, its head will get bigger. As you saw, it'll grow taller. Pat, pat. We died from a dog. Do we have to actually do this whole sand thing again? Okay, no. Gosh, dang it, man. I'm just gonna skip to where we were. But I'll do this, obviously. This was actually a pretty easy fight anyway, so it doesn't matter. Alrighty, so we are back to where we were. And now let's go forward. And let's try not to die from this thing again. So, so it was the Toby Fog. What? Freaking dog? Gosh. Oh, well. Yeah, it's already. It's I'm not gonna do the trick because I don't want to do the trick. And yeah. Yes, we'll take a piece of your snowman. Okay, let's go. Do we actually have it? Yeah, okay, we have it. What is this gonna do? Alright, so we have Tough Glove. I'm guessing that gives us, like, defense or something like that. Um, something I did want to talk about was after this. 
um, the timeline for Breath of the Wild. But yeah, we'll do this. Again. I think that's car sleeping. Excuses, excuses, excuses. Oh, how the human arrives in order to stop you. My brother and I have created some puzzles. I think you'll we'll find this one quite shocking. For you see, this is in the invisible electricity maze. When you touch the walls of this maze, this orb will administer it. How does that? Sound like fun because the amount of fun you probably have is actually rather small, I think. Okay, you can go ahead now. <laughs> He's up himself. Sadies, what did you do? I think he would just hold the orb. Oh, okay. Thanks, Papyrus. Hold this, please. Okay, try now. Like, kind of just like, here was the path, so. Incredible, you stood in the prison. You solved it so easily, too easily. However, the next puzzle will not be easy. It was designed by my brother Sans. He will surely be confounded. I know I am. <laughs> seems like hey, thanks. My brother seems like he's having fun. By the way, did you see the weird outfit he was wearing? We made that a few weeks ago from a costume party. He hasn't worn anything else since. He keeps calling it his battle body. Man, isn't my brother cool? <laughs> yep, he's totally cool. Oh, look at this guy. He's kind of sad. I don't understand why these aren't selling. It's the perfect weather for something cold. Oh, a customer! Hello, would you like some nice cream? It's a frozen treat that wounds your heart. Now just 15 go. Yeah, you know what, let's take one. There you go. Have a super duper day. Nice. Nice cream. Alright, here's another Easter egg. I don't even know if you call it Easter egg. It's just kind of something they can do. Let's do this at least. Um. We have to hit this. Gosh, dang it. No. Gotta hit this to the end. Crap, I think it melts too. Yeah, it's melting, so. Wait, what? No. Gosh, dang it. Yeah, we had to hit in this hole. I don't even know what it gave us, but whatever. We won't do it. Oh, there's another one. Yeah, I don't wanna do it. I've been thinking about selling treats too. I want some fried snow. Just five gold. I want 50 gold. Really? How about 500 gold? No. <laughs> oh my gosh. Smell danger rating. Snow smell snowman white racing. Rating. Can become yellow rating. Unsuspicious smell. Puppy blue rating. Weird. What? Alright, so those are two dogs that we are going to battle soon just so you know it looks like a snowball actually it's a snow to share in drone oh, okay human i hope you're ready for sans where's the puzzle it's right there on the ground trust me there's no way they can get past this one Alright, let's do it. Monster Kids Word Search. Hey kids, can you help me solve this puzzle? <laughs> Sans? That didn't do anything. Oops. I knew it should have been used today. It's crossword instead. What? Crossword? I can't believe you said that. In my opinion, Junior Jumbo is easily the hardest. What? Really? Hmm. It's easy peasy for scrambling. That's the four baby bones. Ah, uh, believable. Human solve this dispute. Jumble. Ha! Ha! Yes! Humans must be very intelligent. If they also find Junior Jumble so difficult. <laughs> Thanks for saying Junior Jumble just to appease my brother. Yesterday he got stumped 
trying to solve the horoscope. LOL. Alright, now we can save. Knowing the mice might one day find the heat of the spaghetti. It feels you want determination. Alright, so Breath of the Wild, where is the timeline? And I don't, I'm pretty sure they haven't released an official timeline yet. So, my question is, um, um, anyways, they haven't released a, an official timeline, so it doesn't make any sense. Like, I thought they would have by now released one, but apparently not. Alright, so we've got some good stuff here. Um, but I think that, like, I, I was about to make a video on this. Um, but I think that it is after, or it's in the, I think it's in the, um, adult era, or the downfall or something, in that timeline, where Ocarina splits and stuff. Oh yeah, we're supposed to say it has a, we're supposed to ignore it. Um, yeah, but I think that it does. I think it goes there, and hopefully, that is right. But, I don't know, because they haven't released it, so it's kind of weird. It's been a while now. And I'll try, I actually might do a live stream of the new DLC, because I have it. So we can do that in a day or two, probably. Better a hatter than a hater. Wait, right, can you just sit here? You can just sit there. In the middle, you don't even have to move. Jerry eats powdery foods and licks his hand around me. There we go. 13 gold. Where's this? an X, so, yeah, there's a switch hidden in the snow, click, alright, so we click the switch, and now, we can play Zelda on it now, click the switch, well, now these two dogs with axes are gonna come up, and we might die, Identify your smell. Nice music. Hmm, that's a weird smell. It makes me want to eliminate. Eliminate you. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, these guys are actually kind of hard. How am I supposed to attack? How am I supposed to dodge that? Gosh dang it. Actually, though, how am I supposed to dodge that? Sorry for yelling a little bit. Gosh damn it. Ha ha, you little dog ass. Ha ha, gotcha, you can't get me now. What the? Okay, it didn't do that last time. It didn't get us last time, but... Alright, so we just did that attack. Oh my goodness! I'm bad at this game, but... How are you supposed to dodge that? Nuts. It didn't really do anything, because we're just gonna go straight back to it, but... Dang it. Oh my jeez. <laughs> you 
we did Jerry. Oh my goodness, okay then. Well, how did I dodge all that? Oh, Jerry's back. What's up, bro? Thought we ditched you. Return of Jerry. This game's pretty funny, actually. I mean, your attack is pretty bad, Jerry. I'm just saying. Get a better attack. Oh, well, you got us. You and their monster did carry. Well, there's no other monsters, so. Hey, we got 25 gold from that, so. Whatever. I'll take it, I guess. That. Ah, oh. So I'm gonna roll around first. What? How are we supposed to dodge that? Like, seriously. Oh, we can go back. Okay. That makes more sense. That makes more sense. Oh, nice. We're done. Okay, we can spare him. Noise. 40 gold. Nice. Dogs can put other dogs. The new world has opened up for us. Thanks, weird puppy. Yep, yeah, no, no problem. It's your everyday puppy. Alright, what's, what's going on here? Turn X to know, then press the switch. Alright. Got one X to know. Two X. And then press the switch. Nice. Nice. What? How did you avoid my trap? And more importantly, is there any left for me? Really? Wow, you. You resisted my flavor of the whole good pasta? Just so you could share it with me? Fret not, human. I master chef Papyrus. We'll make you all the pasta you could ever want. <laughs> ah, yeah, okay. My brother studied a sock collection recently. How saddening. Sometimes I wonder what he would do without such a cool guy taking care of him. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Alright. Human. Hmm. How do I say this? You were taking a long time to arrive, so I decided to improve this puzzle by arranging the snow to look more like my face. Unfortunately, the snow froze to the ground. Now the solution is different. And as usual, my lazy brother is nowhere around. I suppose what am I saying is, worry not, human. I, the great Papyrus, would solve this countrodom. Then we can both proceed. Meanwhile, feel free to try to puzzle yourself. 
I'll try not to give you away the answer. Um, I'm... I think there's a switch somewhere that, like... On one of these puzzles, like, you can just... There's, yep, yeah, there's a switch right here, so we can just do that, but... Yeah, I'm not gonna do that. We're gonna do the puzzle just the legit way. Spikes just went down. <laughs> wow, we you solved it. Right, whatever. He just says a bunch of random stuff about the puzzle and stuff about himself. And there is Sans the Skeleton. You must be really good at puzzles, huh? I mean, it's impossible for you to have seen this one before. Alright, here's the hard one. Hey, it's the human. You're gonna love this puzzle was made by the great Dr. Alphys. You see the tiles, once I do the switch, they will begin to change color. Each color has a different function. Red tiles are impassable, you cannot walk on them. Yellow tiles are electric, they will electrocute you. Green tiles are alarm tiles. If you step on them, you will have a to fight a monster. Orange tiles are orange scented, they will make you smell delicious. Blue tiles are water tiles, swim through if you like. If you smell like oranges, the pyranas will bite you. Also, if the blue tile is next to a yellow tile, the water will also zap you. Purple tiles are slippery. You will slide to the next tile. However, the slippery soap smells like lemons, which the piranhas do not like. Purple and blue are okay. Finally, the pink tiles. They do not do anything. Step on them and you all you like. How was that... How was that understand? Oh, okay. Of course. Great. And there's one last thing. This puzzle is entirely random. When I pull the switch, it will make a puzzle that has never been seen before. Not even I will know the solution. <laughs> so pink and blue are good things. <laughs> oh my gosh. You didn't see anything you just left because... Actually, that's spaghetti from earlier. It wasn't too bad for my brother. Since he started cooking lessons, he's been improving a lot. I bet if he keeps it up next year, he'll even make something edible. Well, that's nice. Jeez. Aware of dog. Please, Brett. On the floor inside is a box of palm raisins. <laughs> this dog is strangely blinking. Blankly in this, to the smell waiting for you to turn into art. Knowing that the dog will never give up trying to make the perfect snow dog. It fills you with determination. Alright, let's talk to this thing. That dog considers itself an artist, but doesn't even want to create. It probably doesn't help that its brain is the size of a piece of kibble. Well, that's me. Um, and it's waiting for art in the way that you actually make it. Like, go do the art thing and, like, build a snow dog. Uh, you have to pet lesser dog's head. That's basically what you gotta do. Oh, oh, we did. Oh, that's great. Papyrus sands is a rock. Let's do this. 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 
This, this, and this. Damn it! No! Gosh dang it. Alright. We got it this time, right? this thing. Something might be on top of her head. Oh, there's a hat. There's a snow hat. Nice. Your sins. What's up? Uh, is that what you're saying? That's all. Okay, you're over here now. <laughs> Googly eyes that you found on the ground. Gosh damn. Stop it. Stop it. Do this again. Nice. Alright. Actually, okay, never mind. I was like, what what what's down that path to the left? That's just where we came up when you fall. It's nothing. Let's go down here. Let's not go down here because I already know it's down there. It's just a door that we cannot do anything in. It's snow puff. And this is a snow puff. This, however, is a snow puff. Surprisingly, it's a snow puff. Snow puff. It's really a snow puff. Behold, a snow puff. Eh, there's 30G inside this. What is this? Oh, there's a dog. Oh, cute, cute. <laughs> Not. <laughs> He's huge. And we gotta find it. I like this music, it's so fun. What? What the heck? Chill. Bark, 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 frick. Gosh damn it. It falls asleep and it wakes up. It's so excited. Gosh dang it, why'd I move? Greater dog wants some TLC. Thank you. 
<laughs> what? I actually never knew this could happen. Gosh dang it! No! You know what? Frick it. That's great. Illuminati confirmed. Let's try to be good this time and not die. And so we first we gotta back in it. No. Gosh, Pet it. And we can play with it. Ignore. Ignore. Yes, nice. Just closer. I've never seen this before. I didn't know that you could do that. Rotation. Get your hands on the keyboard. Gosh dang it. Nice. We're too boring. I don't know what TLC means, but yeah, we're too boring and yeah, you don't want to see us. Human, this is your final, most dangerous challenge. Behold the gauntlet of deadly terror. Jeez, when I say the word, it will fully activate. Cannons will fire, spikes will sling, blades will slice. Each part will swing violently up and down. Only the tiniest chance of victory will remain. Are you ready? Because I am about to do it. Well, what's the hold up? Hold up? What hold up? I'm, a, I'm about to activate it now. That, that uh, doesn't look like very activated. Well, this challenge, it seems maybe too easy to defeat him. Yeah, we can't use this one. I am a skeleton with standards. My puzzles are very fair. And my traps are extreme. Expertly cooked. But this method is too direct. No class at all. Away it goes. Thank you. Phew. What are you looking at? This is another decisive victory for Papyrus. Yeah. 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 Okay. So he tried to kill us, but then he's like, yep. Yeah, uh, actually, no, I don't want to kill you because I think you're cool. I don't know what's going on with the brother. If I were you, I would make sure I understand blue attacks. Okay. And we're at Snowden, so this is where I was going to stop, but let's just go ahead. Yeah, but Snowden is a town, and that's where Papyrus and Sands live. And we can save here, so. It fills you with determination. Nice. So we've been playing for. What? 62 minutes. So about an hour. How is the recording so long? Like it's at 44 minutes. Use the box? No. 
So there's a shop, there's an inn, there's an igloo to go to different places super fast. Yeah, but this is Snowden. We'll explore it more in the next episode. So this is the end of this one. Thank you for everyone that came out to watch it. Thank you for coming to the end if you made it. Um, and tell me if you guys think this is a fun game and if I should keep doing it. I'm obviously going to finish this series, but I can do neutral and genocide. So if you guys want me to do that, make sure to leave a comment. And as always, make sure to stay tuned and subscribe. Goodbye.